Hello my dear family members, as you all know that Accenture asks first coding question from string or array and second coding question from mostly dynamic programming. But sometimes they ask from linked list as well. Meanwhile on 12 September a coding question was asked called height of tree. Seeing the name students got astonished. How can they ask such question in AAC role? But friends this was not from data structure wala tree. This is actually question related to 2D array, right? This question was asked in the previous year as well. So let's see what is the question. So the question was related to height of tree, right? So a tree is represented by the following structure. Struct tree height int feet int inches. You are given a function int tallest tree struct tree height trees in 10 the function accepts an array trees of type tree height consisting of n elements as its argument tree height consists of two integers feet and inches which represents height of a tree implement the function to find the tallest tree among the trees and return its height in inches right height of tree is equal to 12 multiply feet plus inches assumption i mean the instruction i mean the constraints are given here like this follow that and the note that computed value lies within integer range return minus 1 if tree is null none in case of python tree 0 is the first element right okay the sample input is given like the fits are given in the first index and the inches are given in the second index of any array right okay the first array is 10 4 the second array is 23 5 the third is 21 2 277 right so if this is the input then the output will be 331 the maximum height right how this is explained here if the tree is tree's height is 10 4 then 10 multiply by 12 plus 4 is equal to 124 and the second tree 23 5 so 23 multiply by 12 plus 5 is equal to 28 281 and for the third one 21 2 so 21 multiply with 12 plus 2 is equal to this 254 and for the last tree that is 27 7 so 27 multiply 12 plus 7 is equal to 331 so among the all calculated value the 331 is the maximum number maximum value of in inches right so the output will be 3331 so similar way in, in the second input it is working for like 4 6 multiply 12 plus 10 and 5 5 multiply 12 plus 6 among them this will be sorry whichever will be the maximum height in inches that will be the answer that is 666 six, six, right okay let's go to the solution part before i proceed to the solution i would request you to please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding accenture on campus coding question and accenture previous year coding questions as this question was asked in the previous year as well right Okay, let's see what is the solution. So at first define the function def main. I am not taking the function, right? You implement that. I am just giving you the logic. So at first read the input, int input, and initialize an empty list to store the tree heights, right? So array is equal to empty list. And now read the tree heights in feet and inches and store them in a list, right? So for this we have to run a for loop for i in range of n right. So now just feet and inches is equal to map int input dot split right. Sorry. Now append the value in the list right. So we are actually implementing the 2D array. That's why we are appending the array inside an array, right? So array dot append fits fits inches, right? If you could not understand any moment of the video, then please let me know, right? I will be there with you. Okay, now initialize a variable to store the maximum height. So max height 
is equal to let's say 0. Okay, now iterate through the list of tree heights to calculate the height in inches for the current tree or uh, for, for all tree, right? Okay, now run a for loop again for i in range n. So, initialize a temporary variable to calculate that part, right? So, array i first index multiply with 12 as per the formula given, right? ARR i, sorry, ARR 0 i 1, right? I am making you understand what I have written here, right? Okay, now update the max height if the current tree is taller right so if max height is less than temp then max height should be is equal to temp right okay now just print the value of uh, max height it will be okay print max height I hope this will give proper output. Let's just add the uh, driver code, right? If name is equal to is equal to main, then just call the function main. Okay, now I hope this is okay. Just run the run for first input that is two and 4 6 space 10 5 5 space 6 so this is 6 6 6 as expected right and for first input the input was 4 then 10 space 4 23 space 5 21 space 2 and 27 space 7 right so the output is 3 3 1 i hope you have got the logic right actually there should be uh, number 4 right okay let's see what is the explanation here so when we took the second input that is stored like this so when we are iterating through all the elements all the indexes of the array then this is 0 this is 1 right so at first i is equal to 0 so we are supposed to multiply that fits with 12 and adding with in inches right so the first index was 12 sorry fits and the second index was inches so this is 46 is feet and this is inches so you have to multiply this with 12 then add with 10 right so we have to this is 0 0 this is 0 1 this is 1 0 this is 1 1 right so we have to multiply this 0 0 multiply with 12 plus this 0 1 right this is what we have done here right so i hope this is clear to you right so if you found this video helpful then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding accenture on campus coding question and accenture previous year coding question as, as well right because this is asked in the previous year right so thank you for today's session